Hey, what's up guys? Are you looking for a very modern townhouse built by TriPoint and you're looking in the southwest side of Las Vegas? Well, in this video, we are here at Southridge and we're gonna be touring their largest floor plan, the plan three, so stay tuned. What's up guys welcome back to my channel if you guys are new to my channel if this is your very first time tuning in my name is dale abella with exp realty i'm a local realtor here in las vegas now what we do on my channel is we go over all the new build communities here in las vegas so if this is something you're interested in if you're looking to move to las vegas or if you like looking at new home build tours do me a favor guys hit the subscribe button hit the like button hit the notification button that way you stay up to date with all the news communities here in Las Vegas. So welcome to South Point Ridge by TriPoint Homes. Now today we are here in the southwest side of Las Vegas. Just to give you guys an idea of where we're located, the nearest cross streets is going to be Silverado Ranch in Decatur. So we're really close to the 15 freeway. Now if you're looking for a place that's easy access to the freeway, only takes about 15 to 20 minutes to get to the Las Vegas airport and the strip, uh, this is definitely a community worth considering. Now guys, I will have the floor plans on the screen for you, okay? So they offer four different floor plans here. They offer the plan one, two, two X, and three. They're gonna range from about 1642 square feet all the way up to 1899 square feet with the base prices ranging from 402 all the way up to 438, okay? Whenever you see base price, just know that lot premium and upgrades are not included. So the lot premiums here, so for upgrades, I would factor in about 10% of the base price. So I wanna say at most you'd be spending about, you'd be under like 40,000 for upgrades that you'd be putting in these townhomes. Now lot premiums are gonna range between uh, 3,000 to 5,000. That's like the median lot premiums, but they do have larger lot premiums as well that uh, will be 15 to 20,000. Some of those lots will include like an 18 foot driveway. So if having like a driveway matters to you, then, you know, you could definitely do one of those here. They're going to be doing a little mixture of doing spec homes as well as building from lot up. So it just kind of depends on when you get in because they do have some homes. They already picked out the options. They'll be ready in about three or four months. But if you came in earlier and you want to completely choose all your options, your structural upgrades, they are open to that. You just have to uh, like a further close date, but they'll accommodate you. Okay. So as far as the HOA, goes $210 a month is going to include a pool cornhole dock park exterior paint the roof street maintenance I believe it is gated too so but yeah, just shoot me a text and I'll double check that for you they're gonna have 86 homes here something really nice about these townhomes are all gonna have backyards too so if you have pets and you're considering a townhome well yeah this one has a backyard it's gonna be about 10 to 13 feet deep okay but uh yeah let's get started with the tour all right guys welcome to the plan three this is gonna be the largest floor plan in this community um, this is going to be 1899 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half bath, two car garage, and the plan threes will always be an end unit. Okay. So, uh, right now this would be the two car garage, but that, that's the sales office. The two car garage is on the other side there. Okay. Now all these townhomes are also going to have a backyard as well. Okay. The, with the, the plan three, you're going to have like a, a side yard and a backyard, but yeah, let's check it out. Um, it's very open in here. I actually like this floor plan a lot. So welcome in. So as soon as you like walk in, you're immediately greeted by the living room, kitchen, and dining room. But it's also nice too because if you look up, I mean you have you have the high ceilings. I love that they upgraded the um, the stair rail so that way it looks more open. Okay. So very open floor plan. Just in case this is one of your first videos that you are watching, you know, while we're touring a model house, the model homes are always, uh, they always have a lot of upgrades in it, okay? So just some basic upgrades that I will point out, some upgrades that buyers will always normally do when they move into, um, you know, when they're picking a model and upgrading, uh, like the floor, the flooring is upgraded. Now, the standard flooring, you'd have carpet all throughout the house, except for the wet areas like the kitchen, laundry room, bathroom, and entryway. Uh, but most buyers will always like upgrade the, uh, to hard flooring on the first floor. So something like this, okay? 
So here, we'll uh, we'll take a look at back here. Look at the backyard. So it's actually, it's, it's really great that this townhouse community offers backyards because sometimes there's a lot of buyers that are interested in townhomes, but they have a pet and a lot of the townhomes don't have the backyards, but this could definitely uh, work for buyers having pets. So, okay. Also guys, we are in the Southwest, great area, easy access to the 15 freeway. So if that's important to you, Man, this is, it's literally right next to the highway. I mean, not like next to it where you could just like hear it, but just like a minute drive. Okay. So let's check out this kitchen. Okay. Beautiful upgraded kitchen. We got the optional quartz, the optional, um, I think that's like blue cabinets. It's like dark cabinets, it's nice. Got the backsplash going on as well, okay. Some of the standard features for the kitchen is uh, you would actually have, you would have a quartz countertop that'd be included, okay, but not this, this not this quartz. Um, you all have, you all, the standard option would be a stainless steel dual basin sink, okay, so you have this nice optional white single basin sink. So also these pools, these uh, matte black pools are optional as well, okay. Otherwise you would get the, um, the birch cabinets would be standard and then you would have the, uh, the satin nickel knobs, okay. Appliances are not included guys. So um, you will get the dishwasher, the oven, microwave, but refrigerator, washer and dryer will not be included. Okay, so you have your pantry right here. Okay, also guys, it is uh, nine foot ceilings, which is good. So you're gonna have the powder room right here. Very cool wallpaper. And then here's your coat closet. Okay. And that's the door to the garage, but uh, there's a sales office in there, so can't go in there. Okay, guys, so. So we got a landing stair right here, but this is what you see as soon as you're walking up. Okay. I, I, I really do like this floor plan a lot for a townhouse. Yes, yeah, so it definitely feels spacious. You have a nice cozy loft right over there. Okay. So yeah, um, over here, you're gonna have your guest bedrooms. And it's also nine foot ceilings. Actually, I'm sorry, it's eight foot ceilings on the second floor. So you got your full bath, bedroom one, bedroom two. Laundry room, okay, and your primary bedroom is going to be over there, so. So welcome to the full bath. So you do have the dual sinks here, okay. You have your upgraded matte black fixtures, okay, fiberglass shower tub. Okay, let's take a look at these cabinets. Okay, quartz countertop. All right. Now a couple of standard options as well. Like uh, there's a, these baseboards are uh, five inch baseboards. So that is uh, optional. Standard is three and a half inch baseboards. Okay. And then also too, um, you're actually, um, the corner edging is gonna be uh, the flat square corner edging that's standard okay so welcome to bedroom one, number one so it's pretty spacious it's larger than a 10 by 10 so this is probably 11 by 12 this is a full-size bed okay you got your pre-wire to the ceiling fan which is uh optional in guest bedrooms 
the spec homes that they make. The spec home meaning the quick moving homes. Uh, most likely they'll add a pre-wire for the ceiling fan in every room. Okay, so this is nice. It has a walk-in closet. Okay, with a window. Okay. All right, here's the other guest bedroom. So pretty spacious as well. Okay, so welcome to the laundry room. Again, the washer and dryer is not included um those cabinets are also an optional as well okay um so this is your smart panel box this is going to be where your coax cables is your cat six is your uh we're gonna keep your router and your modem all right you got the fire sprinklers over there okay also, too, if you look up there, uh, those are going to be the transfer transfer grills to regulate the airflow. Okay. Cool. And then the primary bedrooms, they're not going to have transfer grills. So the primary bedroom is going to also, it's going to have more privacy. You're going to have these jumper ducts. Okay. So it's going to regulate airflow, but at the same time, it's better because it, you know, with transfer grills, sound gets uh, transferred pretty easily. So definitely more privacy with the primary bedroom. Nice, okay, we got a nice little balcony over here. All right guys, so look, that's South Point Hotel Casino. See this road right here? This road is Silverado Ranch. Yeah, the, the freeway is literally just, let me see if, okay, well the freeway is by, by South Point. Now guys, if you are interested in a new build community and you are thinking about visiting, guys, do me a huge favor, give me a call, shoot me a text. I'd love to assist you on your very first visit and um, represent you. If you guys are using a realtor, um, no worries. At least let your realtors know, let your realtor know that you're interested in a new build community. Make sure they go with you on your very first visit. The thing is, if you go on your very first visit and uh, without no agent and you give the builder agent your name, your number, phone number. They won't let you have representation down the road. Uh, the problem with that is the builder agents look after the builder's best interest and we look after your best interest. So we negotiate for you. We hold the builders accountable. We uh, make sure you get all the max incentives. And plus the, the builders pay the agent fees. So it's definitely a win-win. But yeah, give me a call if you are interested, okay? So welcome to the primary bedroom. It's... Very spacious in here. So we do have the king size bed. Um, you will get a pre-wired ceiling fan. Um, that's gonna be standard in the primary bedrooms. Um, let's see here. Ceiling fan, pre-wire. So we got the upgraded cabinets, countertop, the flooring, okay. Okay, so got the fiberglass shower tub. And uh, see, so this is gonna be your walk in closet. You also have the attic access right up here. Okay. And you have your toilet room. Oh, another closet. Okay. There you go. But yeah, that pretty, that's pretty much it for the plan three. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you have any questions, if you're curious to know what the incentives are, guys, reach out to me. Um, give me a call, shoot me in text. Until then, I will catch you guys next video.